Today I'm going to be making music, but every single sound is going to be made with Google Translate. Google Translate. <laughs> this is going to be really bad. Now, anyway, to get started, I think I'm just going to do a little drum loop. So I've just loaded up the German language and I'm just going to put in some random words and hopefully they make some sounds. I think for a kick drum, we could go for a doom. How's that sounding? Doom. Doom. That's pretty perfect. What about a tum? Tum. Nah. Or a rum? Tum. Tum. That's pretty good. Tum. Yeah, I think it's got to be that one. Now, what do we do for a hi-hat? Can we just go tis? <laughs> rum t e s. Ah. Oh, what about like that? Rum t. <laughs> Wait, so if I just loop that over and over, how's that going to sound? Rum t, rum t, rum t. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> We're getting rid of those R's. I think I'll go for the dum. I think that should work better. Dum tea, dum tea, dum tea. <laughs> dum. <laughs> I'm not sure about those hi hat sounds. What about a s? How's that going to sound? Dum si. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay. Dum ka. No, no, that's really a snare though. What if we go a little something like that? Dum si ka si, dum si ka si. Dum si ka. That's pretty much perfect. I could just copy and paste this over. It should be good. Yay! So now I'm just going to take that boy, put it over there, quantize it into time. That is way off. Yes, that is going to be good enough for now. I can always tidy it up later on. But now, let's move on to an instrument. Now, for this one, I think I'm just going to use English. And I'm just going to use the letter A. A. Or do we go for an E? E. What about the Chinese e. one? E. E. <laughs> I actually think that one's better. E. Let's use the Chinese E sound. I'm just going to bring it into a simpler. And we're just going to be using it as a normal instrument. It should actually sound pretty decent. <laughs> I like that the Chinese one doesn't have too much pitch variation. It's pretty flat. It's actually in tune as well. But I think I might just run it through Melodyne just to quickly tidy it up. I want this to actually sound... A little bit decent. Put you on C. Flatten you out a bit. Yeah, <laughs> there we go. We have our Chinese E sound. <laughs> that actually sounds really nice. Oh, yeah. Let's record something in. That is sounding really good. Now, I don't really want to use any effects for this video, but I think I might have to because all of my sounds are just going to start sounding the same. So I think I might actually have to use a really small amount of effects. Just a little bit of reverb, a little bit of delay, stuff like that. Oh, it already sounds so much better. Nice. Now, next sound. Now for this one, I want to try to get a long drawn out sound, which I can loop over and over and use as a pad sort of sound. You. <laughs> That's not going to be it. What about Chinese? You. No. German? Ooh. No. Uh... What about that? Uh, I mean, that's kind of what I'm going for. Uh, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh. No. W, W, W. Okay, that's not doing much. What about a who? Who? Whom? That might be a good one. Whom? Whom? Oh, I think whom might be the one. What if I try putting another whom? Is that going to change the pitch? Whom, whom, whom? Oh. Whom, whom, whom? It's a good range of whom's to pick from. Now, which whom is the better whom? Might be this last one, actually. I might just quickly run it through Melodyne just to even it out a bit because it's still a little bit rough. There we go. We have our whom synth. It doesn't really sound like a whom anymore, but that should be all right. Now, what I want to do is I want to drag that over, give it a bit of loop, and then we'll just get a little something like that, fade it in. Okay, that doesn't sound as good as I was expecting it to. I think I might actually just leave it as the stab. What happened there? I think that actually almost sounds like a bass. Should we use it for a bass line? Yeah, that is going to do. Let's record it in. Now, I think one of the last things that I'm going to need for this beat is just going to be a bell sound. So I'm guessing for this, I can just type in... Ding. 
that's actually pretty close. Ding, that actually ding, seems pretty ding. flat as well. I don't think I need to tune it. Maybe I need some effects. Ding, 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 ding. It just sounds like crazy frog. <laughs> Doesn't really sound like a bell. But it might actually work. It just sounds like seagulls. <laughs> oh, let's record something in. Yeah, Google Translate. That is starting to sound really good. Now, I think I see to add in a couple more layers of some little additional things. The first thing that I'm going to do is I'm just going to go back to this drum track that I did. And I'm just going to take out these kick drums. So just put in some hi-hats just like that. What, what happened in the middle? Oh, well, it should be all right. I can just cut out a little bit of that loop. Now we're just going to get a whole bunch of E's. That should do. <laughs> okay, that kind of works. Maybe we'll just flatten that out. <laughs> I don't know what that's meant to be. That is hideous either way. Maybe a bit of reverb. It actually kind of works. What if I pitch it up? <laughs> it actually kind of works. Just a whole bunch of E's. But anyway, now that I'm all done with that, I think I've got everything that I need to finish off this beat. So as usual, I've gone ahead and added on a few finishing touches off camera. And here's my finished beat made using any sounds that came from Google Translate. Enjoy. <laughs> Anyway, there we go, there's my beat made using only sounds from Google Translate. Now this beat actually turned out to be a whole lot better than I was expecting it to be. I thought it was just going to be a joke video where the beat was just complete garbage, but it actually turned out to be decent. Still not very good, but better than I was expecting. But anyway, if you thought it was garbage, make sure to go ahead and let me know down in the comments and I'll see all of you in the next couple of days for my next upload. Thanks for watching everybody. Bye.